nice to have you here on the program. Thank you. Uh, we should talk right away. <laughs> about this. I had a hard time getting a mic on me. Yeah, I wonder why. So, oh, um, oh, there it is, right there. <laughs> I, I can help you with that if you like. <laughs> I'm kind of a technical whiz. Uh, we should talk right away. Don't look at me that uh, way. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, we should talk right away. Let's talk about the diamonds. Yeah, bit. you are wearing a bra yes. that Victoria's Secrets has made that is covered in diamonds. Yes. And it is worth how much money? It is $12.5 million. It has a 90 carat flawless diamond in the front and it's designed by Mawad. It's beautiful. I love it. I wish I could keep it, but I can't. Well, who's going to take that away from you? <laughs> you could probably just say, I am Heidi Klum. This is mine now. I, I am a supermodel. Could, I don't have that much pull. I know a few people have Victoria's Secret, but I don't think they give that to me. Uh, now, let's talk about this bra. It's, re it's, it's 12 point... The whole thing is 12.5. Yes. It's not you know, per there's a lot boob. Of, or so. it's it continues. 12. I can't show you all of it, but it continues. It, it continues, yes. Yes, yes. We can't see more? No, that's fine. We get the idea. <laughs> So what do you mean you can see it tomorrow? Tomorrow night on, on ABC. On ABC. Yes. No one watches that network. They're watching NBC. No, We're the no, best I in the world. I hope watch it tomorrow. <laughs> um, At 9 p.m. it's going to be on. And yes. then you're going to see the whole thing. I have matching panties on for $750,000. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You have to get... Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the morale booster, buddy. Uh, you have... Uh, let me understand. You have... There's a, they're matching panties. Yes. Uh, and, and it's that $750,000? Yep. It's a bargain. Well, well. Also, you probably have to. I mean, you can't. You can't wear the diamond bra and then just go to like get some Hanes cotton underwear, right? You are. You've got to. Have the matching panties. Right. Who buys the? I mean, you know. I don't know. They do it every year. Victoria's Secret always has the catalog uh, for Christmas and their fantasy gifts. Right. And um, every year it gets more expensive and more expensive. Last year I think it was um, 11 uh, million dollars. I did it two years ago. It was a million, uh, 10 million dollar bra. Right. So it always gets bigger and, and bigger. And people are buying them? People are actually like... I don't think anyone has bought it yet, but it's... it's oh, <laughs> okay. I was going to say. Uh, some people are probably buying it by accident. I'm just, I'll get your bra, honey, and just check that box well, on the order it's form. It's like a special thing that they do every year, you know? Right. Yeah. Now, let me ask you about men's underwear. Are they ever thinking of making, like, a diamond-studded <laughs> male underwear? Because I think that's something that would be appropriate for me to have. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I, I No, I just... Like with all the diamonds. You'd like crusted. to see me in my underwear? Is that what you're saying? Well, also because you have to get molded and stuff. What you, do you mean molded? Well, I got molded. You know, this was made for me, so I got molded. Well, tell me so what that means when you got molded. molded. What do they do to you when you got Which, molded? You know, if you want to go through that though, there, it's like, I don't know. <laughs> well, wait a minute. Before we get on to me, when they molded you for this bra, what did well, they this do? It's not made on fabric. This is platinum. Right. So it has to be molded, and then, you know, they, so it fits perfect. So did someone, someone was doing that to you? Someone was putting some kind of mold on you and how do you get that job that's when I want to be great if that's just a summer internship um, sorry my attention strays again well it's very beautiful it looks fantastic no, I like it too. is it comfortable I mean you're wearing 12.5 million dollars worth of well I wouldn't say it is you know something you want to go jogging with it is, it is not that comfortable, but it's, you know, for, you know, having that many diamonds on it, it's, right. it's all right. Yeah. Do, is there an alarm system on it? Is there some kind of the alarm step system away from the breast? It's somewhere. It's the, it's the bodyguards. They're the alarm system. Are there bodyguards there. following you everywhere? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't see them around. Good. I can't. Well, maybe they just That's I make my move. Uh, let's talk about the Victoria. In the panties, when I, when I was putting the panties on, when I was going on the runway, they put on, um, um, you know, those rubber straps so they hold up. And, you know, everything goes so fast backstage when you do the fashion show. It is, like, crazy. Everyone is screaming, tie it out the boots, hurry, hurry, hurry. Because everything, you know, it's, uh, you would think it takes so long, but it's like half an hour, the show is over, and we do so many changes. So someone's literally putting, so the, putting the panties the and the boots on you. Like, the, it's just like, oh, yeah. no, it's like Batman goes down the chute and yeah. he becomes Batman. Exactly, it's almost like that. Okay, it's, but and sexier. Then the, yeah. And then these fans rip. And you don't know, you know, everyone goes crazy. We have an emergency over here. We need a seamstress now. And then, you know, cutting, blah, 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 blah. and then, okay, out. You know, you don't know what happens back there. It's crazy. I don't know because I haven't been invited back there. No I have you invited many times. Don't say that. What are you talking about? I've invited, invited me where? You to come to the show. When, when did you invite? Uh, to the Victoria's Secrets fashion show? Yes. I don't think I got invited to that. I think I would know if I got invited to that. I invited you. You 
have probably handed it to like someone who works here at the show, and they and get these give these tickets to Conan for the show. And he's like, I'll make sure he gets it, ma'am. And then that guy sitting in the front row with a girl on each arm. I love you, Giselle. I've invited you before. Really? I'm sure we can do a playback somewhere, rather. Well, you know. Probably said it when I was sitting right here. Well, really? Well, we'll we'll find it. I'm sure. If you invited me to a Victoria's Secret fashion show, I'd have been there. I'm curious, what kind of, I mean, the strange people sometimes show up in the audience, so there's some kind of weird Baldwin brother in there watching. Regis Philbin was there. Regis Philbin is yes, there? Yes, because we did a Supermodel Millionaire. What? It is going to be, yeah, well, I didn't come up with that, but it is an hour before um, you could see the show. Right. You're on, on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Right. So Regis was there probably yes, hamming it he, up. And so he came by. Yeah. yeah. And, and, and other, was song. Trump, I bet Donald Trump was there. I He's, didn't see him that there. That guy shows up at all those kind of things. I didn't see him there. Yeah, he'd buy the $12.5 million bra and turn it into an apartment building here in the city. <laughs> um... I'm just babbling again. Uh, tell us, these, the, the swimsuit issue is coming out soon. In February. Okay, where did you guys shoot it this year? I can't tell you that. You can't tell us? No, it's always a secret. You know, it comes out in February, February and then we talk about night. it. It's like just a few of us here. You hello, can tell. Hello, and a few at home. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> no, hello. there's no one at home, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> My mom isn't watching this show. I was like, he's foolish. Uh, so, so, you can't tell me? I bet I can guess. I bet I'm very good at deductive reasoning. I bet I could guess it's somewhere warm, right? Because you got to wear the bikinis, it right? Was warm, yeah. Warm, and yeah. I bet there was ocean nearby. No, this time, no, no ocean for me. Every year I've been no going ocean. to some beautiful ocean. No ocean, so ocean. inland, eh? No, what, can you tell I'm not me telling you where, but I was... Give me some clue. Just some... in a lot of doo-doo, and there was a lot of animals around, and it was very different and very good. This sounds like not a very sexy shoe. <laughs> What kind of shoe is this? Well, Wearing a thong bikini, standing in doo doo, you know. leaning on an oxen. At this point, maybe they didn't do like a full length shot that cropped it here somewhere, so right. you wouldn't see what's going on down below. Uh, really? Okay, so a lot of doo doo. Does Sports Illustrated like it when you go around telling people? I don't know. There's a doo doo shoot. You've got to check it out. <laughs> uh, you know, last time you were here, you did something. We got a lot of response. And I just want to. Re you actually remodeled my hair. Yeah. Which a lot of people complain. Which you did not change that since then. I see that. Well, let's just show people if they prefer. Maybe they prefer this. I've got this sort of Bob's Big Boy thing going on. <laughs> this worked very well for me. It's my. It moves. It does everything. Wow. I keep little snacks in here. It's amazing. Little snacks? Yeah, I can do anything with this hair. It's... Like snacks that walk or? Huh? What the? Little. <laughs> no. What do you? T no. There's not vermin in my hair. I may not have a diamond bra, but I clean myself. Okay. Just to be sure. But um, let's show a picture of what you did to my hair last time and see what people think of it. I don't... <laughs> Look at that. I'm kind of... I look like I was playing with a light socket there. Like something went horribly awry. I always go a little crazy with a hairspray. I don't mind. It's, it was nice, you touching my hair. <laughs> yeah, it's nice, right? Oh, it's fluffy. It's very mm. fluffy. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe you say I never invited you to the show. I swear to... Uh, huh? I think I would know. I don't get invited to a lot of things. So next time you're going to come? Yeah, I'll be there. You All better. Right. I'll be there right there with Regis. He'll yeah. be like, Conan, what are you doing here? <laughs> Imagine him in a fashion show. Hey, look at the games on that one. I think it was actually the first fashion show that he's, you he's know, been, he's to. been to. Yeah. He's a very disruptive man. You've got to constantly tranquilize him. No, he's funny. But he, Ritalin and a blowgun. <laughs> Puts him right out. But he had a hard time with us. We were eight models at the show, and at uh, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right. He had a hard time with us. I think. How'd you guys do on the questions? Pretty good. I oh, think. good. Better than I expected. Oh no, <laughs> that's is, scary yeah, to be in that seat. It is very scene, scary. It really yeah. is because you can really make a fool out of yourself. And there's a lot of tough questions. You know, to like thirty thousand, it is somewhat alright. Right. But then the light goes down, boom, boom, <laughs> and then you sit there and whoa, they call it sweat is running down, and you know you have no clue A, B, C, or D, and you just have to like, you know. I love it when you tell a story. <laughs> I really do. Uh, the Victoria's Secrets fashion show is tomorrow night at 9 yep. on ABC. And at 8 is going to be Millionaire.
And we're gonna be on. You all take it watch easy. It. All right. <laughs> They're all gonna. Yeah. All right. It's okay. Exciting. Yeah, I know, have but you, you don't have to run through it? the whole schedule. Have you ever been on it? Been on what? On Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? No, I thought you meant on the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show. Thanks for doing it.